traditional production is not what this is about. This is about storytelling so that the person who comes in who's never been to the opera comes again and again. And the person who's been 65 times to see Aida, maybe even this wonderful Mestres Cabernet's painted sets, has never had an experience like it. All of the sets are painted drops and they're absolutely stunning and old. I think they said they're almost 100 years old, so. You'd have no idea looking at the pictures that they're no. dropped. Yeah. So I'm very excited and I'm very, I'm very happy excited to be as here. well. <laughs> so for every dancer, for every figurante, for every principal, that we understand that we're all part of one big story. That's our job, that's what we've got to do. Io sono debuttante, debutto Radames, debutto al Barcelona, quindi per me è un grande onore e una grande responsabilità con questi grandissimi colleghi. Io a Bonas l'ho fatto tante volte, ma debutto a Barcelona, la prima volta. Mai cantato a Barcelona? Mai cantato a Barcelona. Nice. I feel excited, I think you've done the role many times, yes. it's my debut. Oh, that's amazing. Uh, yeah, yeah, in, in the role, so I'll get inspired by you. <laughs> it's a huge honor to be making my debut here at the Liceo, and it's my debut in Spain as well, but not yours. Not you've been mine. here a while. I've been here many times, although this is my debut at the Liceo. It's so compact. It goes, when it starts, it doesn't stop. It's one thing after another, and there's so many things. Every time when I do a new production of Aida, I get new information, new details, which is, I think it's fantastic. De los más maduros y, y, y más conocidos, que es también lo que nos da gran motivación y gran presión a la vez. Eh, y para mí también, eh, trabajar en un, en un teatro histórico como este, como el Liceo, es una, una gran oportunidad y estoy felicísimo. Someone who's never been to the theatre before, let alone an opera, goes, comes away going, and comes away at the end in tears, because Aida is dead, and so is Radames. That's the question, how do we do that? Verdi tells us how to do it. Through his music, but asking questions the whole time.